Hey guys, welcome to Day Zero's D Pad here on Krypton Radio and YouTube. We're your hosts, Kirby Kid. And Jen. And uh, once again, since we're still recovering from the food coma, we're doing <laughs> both at once. Uh, this uh. may end up becoming our, our new thing because it makes our lives that much easier. Uh, today we're talking about Need for Speed Most Wanted. Yep. I know it's like an older game, but this is kind of like a remake from the first game. Yeah, so it's like the HD version. Um, Super HD. I was excited about the game because I had saw a white charger <laughs> on the commercial. That's and it. then I got the game, and turns out that was a Slim Jim thing that a you Slim had to Jim get. promotion? Yeah. Oh. So it's not in the game, and I only rented it, so I'm not going to go buy Slim Jims to try and get it. I am so sorry. Yeah. Wait, you just have to buy two Slim Jims? No, I think it's like... Like, there's like a random code that you can get or something, and I think that thing's already over. Oh. So I was like, you know what? I'll just drive the Challenger, the baby Charger. Ah, 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 um, ah. I, the game is, it feels too flimsy and not real, and there's not much to do, and you really can't customize the cars what you it's want. It's extremely limited. Yeah, the, the colors are random. You can't even pick your own color. Oh, that's retarded. Why would you do that? I don't know. You can't, you can't change your. You can't change your rims. You can't change much of anything. Now, granted, we didn't we haven't played that far into it, but we've we've already got on the most wanted list. Yeah, so, that was quite, pretty easy. Yeah. Uh, keep in mind after your first race, keep chasing the car. Right. Because right. You, you have to chase him down, beat him up, and take his car from him. Yeah. Uh, we kind of learned that the hard way. You'll be seeing uh, the, the retries right now, all the crashes <laughs> that happened. Sorry. <laughs> but once you got him, though, uh, which took forever, but once you found him, you, you found a, a better car, like, you know, the Batmobile, which seemed pretty <laughs> awesome. That one, that car only has one color. <laughs> Black. Yeah. But the concept car, uh, one quick note about chasing, chasing people down. If you don't get to them in time, they disappear. And then they reappear. Yeah, randomly. he magically reappeared, which just kind of mind-boggled us. And he, he he appeared like behind us like three or four times. Yeah, just to hit us. Yeah, I'm like, okay, where's this guy? I'm chasing after him. I crash, and all of a sudden, boom! He crashes into me, and I'm like, what the? What just happened here? Yeah. Uh, and then when he's off in the in like in the distant, you know, road, sometimes he'll just teleport back to you. Oh yeah. That's a kicker. That's a kicker. That's embarrassing. <laughs> He's like, let me just use my concept car from the future and teleport back to you. It's like, why didn't you just teleport to us or away from us yeah. if you're really going to do that? But uh, well, oh, one thing you'll see that, that brought us a lot of joy was the Charger Cop car. Um, <laughs> this dude was a jerk. He, he's a, it's an NPC who just kept getting in the way. <laughs> he got the billboards before us. Mm-hmm. He got everything. He tried to kill you. It was, it was fantastic. He killed you right after you, you um, got full health again, too, which mm-hmm. is hilarious. Oh, my but God. Speaking that, of that was too funny. There are fix-it places that you could drive through. It repairs all the damage and changes the color. Now, you can drive through it without having to stop, which is good. But the bad thing is you can drive out through it and then get killed immediately <laughs> afterwards. Uh, other fun hints. Watch out for spikes. Yeah, that that's kind of hard to see sometimes. Well, like, it's sometimes like it's over a hill or on top of a hill, and you can't see it because you're trying to get through the hill. Right. Or you could pull, you know, what Jin did, and have me warn him a good half an hour before it happened, and have him still <laughs> run through it. But if you see a cop car off to the side, just sitting there, there are spikes right in front of it. So try and go around it. Yeah. Now. I'm more of a Midnight Club player, and you're more of a Forza player. Uh, Forza, so GTA, GTA. Basically, GTA, this game is just not Turismo, our cup of tea to begin with. Um, I have to be honest, this is my first Need for Speed, most likely my last. <laughs> How sad. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I mean, like there wasn't that many ga- uh, cars. Uh, my car wasn't in it, you know. <laughs> uh, and it just... It seems very limited. Plus, EA makes you have to sign up for an EA membership in order to go online. It's not enough to have Xbox Live or PSN. <laughs> yeah. You have to have their stupid thing, which is a whole other thing that you don't have to do. Mm-hmm. And the thing I hate with that is that's probably part of the um, way they're killing the used market, where it's going to make you have to register the game or some bullcrap, you know? Mm-hmm. So EA, that's that's not good. No, no, it's not. Stop making it register for your for your crap. Yeah. Wait, how much did you pay th- for this? Um, I actually rented this from Blockbuster because oh. I knew the game was going to be fun for about five minutes. <laughs> was it fun for about five minutes? It was fun for about four and a half. Oh, yeah, just they, short. They fell short. Just short. Um, it's a fun game. Like if you're in the Need for Speed, you'll you'll probably love this. Um, if you're in the Midnight Club, 
you won't love this. If you're into Forza or any of the other more more realistic games, you will not love this. No, I I had such a hard time just trying to drift. I don't know if you'll ever put it up or anything, but uh, we I will. It it should be playing right about now, hopefully. Okay, so the one way you can drift uh, is just tilting the controller and just going in circles or yep. something of that co- of that sort. I'm just trying to drift in general. You know, like coming from like Forza GT and some other you know games that you where you can drift and whatnot. And when I tr- hold down the E brake, because that's usually yeah. you know like how you do it, um, it stops. Like the 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 car just completely stops. And if you hold it too long, you go backwards. Um, or that. Or yeah. And, and also one problem you said you had was that there was no gear shifting. Oh, uh, yeah. That's another thing that really irked me. See, I'm more of a manual shifter. So, I would like to shift in my car, you know, just in case or something, or use that utility to drift or anything else for that matter, you know. And they don't have that. I'm so irked about that. Yeah. Oh my god. I like automatic, so it doesn't really bother me, but there's probably a lot of people out there who like to do manual. I mean, it's in every car game in arcades. Yeah, and so why don't you give me this... You know, ability. Now, I'm wondering though, maybe if you have the, the driving wheel, if that option's added. And also, I know this game has connect abilities, which gives you different viewpoints and a few other things. True. So, we may not be able to experience the full capabilities of it. But as it is right now, it seems kind of bare. <laughs> Just bare? That's that's really it? That you're gonna leave? Well, you have like eight cars and you can drive. And look, it looks really nice. Yeah. Okay, let's get some pros in here. Right. Some pros. Once you get past the loading screen of Infinity, uh, <laughs> you, you're treated to some really nice, awesome visuals. Like, yeah. the reflections are nice, the detail is good, um, the music is... It's okay. It's, it's pretty confusing. Easy. Like, if you, if you actually listen to the lyrics, you're like, what? <laughs> like, those words are not connected at all. <laughs> but um, the atmosphere is nice. I'm hoping they add more onto it. I know there's online, there's versus, there's a whole other things that we haven't done, which I'm sure adds a whole lot of fun to it. There's a whole social aspect to this game. They, they mentioned different social things, but we haven't tried that because we're not signing up for EA. Uh, but yeah, it's well, some good points. It's a nice uh, way to reboot, I guess. If they're gonna if they're gonna build off this game, great. Yeah. If they're gonna leave it the way it is, then not I'm as great. Sorry, you you don't you do not deserve my money for this. One. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, so. Overall, if you had to like rate this game or sum up your feelings, what would you what would you give it? <laughs> give me back my money. <laughs> wow, that he didn't spend money and he would like me back. <laughs> give me back money for the time I spent on your game. <laughs> yeah, it's. I was kind of mad. I couldn't use that time to play uh, Storm or Skylanders, oh. which is a really fun game, which I'm not getting into. Okay, well we will we we will discuss we that will later. We'll do episode of Skylanders eventually. Uh, Skylanders Giants is amazing. I bought it during Black Friday. <laughs> the eighty dollars starter set went for fifty dollars. Not and bad. Also forty dollars at Walmart that we didn't know until literally five minutes later. But, of course. But still, it's a really fun game, and we'll talk about that next week on D-Pad. Yeah. Uh, you'll see some gameplay footage. There's a versus mode, which we will hopefully get a chance to play. Yeah. And then um, you know. Let's let's get back to the game just real quick. What what else is there to talk about? Um, the realism of it, just well, I mean, just okay. crashing. Okay, Every when you crash into a car, you're supposed to die. Yeah, or but you're, when you crash into a car, your car's supposed to slow down. Or when you g- jump over spikes, you're supposed to slow down. Especially if you're hitting rims. None of that happened, and I am very very irked about that. But see, the thing is. The cars are made of like super titanium. Oh God! Don't give me that. <laughs> like I'm, I'm really sure that they're they're just made of awesome stuff. No, no, just. I'm sorry. I'm more of a realism person when it comes to, you know, yeah. these type of racing games. You know, and honestly, just if you're into realistic games, you know, like uh, what was it? Uh, Forza. Forza. Uh, Gran Turismo. And some other stuff, any, any other game that's similar to that, don't bother. I'm sorry. But if you like, you know, like the the more of the fantasy aspect of it, which is great, don't get me wrong. Yeah. It's just, I'm not a fantasy it's type. It's the of- only way that these little tiny foreign cars are going to survive hitting a, a lamp. <laughs> because in the real world, if the wind blows, they crumple into tin cans. <laughs> 
So, or if you get hit by a charger, you would Oh my would god, the charger die. is so deadly accurate in this game. It just it oh eats the road. It's so funny. But uh, yeah, I thought I I got the game for free through a rental thing at Blockbuster and kind of mad, kind of upset. It wasn't what I thought it was going to be. No. But hey, you know, hopefully as I play it, my my opinion of it will change, and so I'll take it back for something else. Uh, but. For now. For now, that's, that's kind of it. That's how I feel about it. So tune in next week, um, Sunday at 5 o'clock, for our Skylanders episode. Yep. Check out our YouTube channel, mm-hmm. slash Day Zero TV. Remember, that's a zero, four With, no. Yeah, an actual zero. Yeah, check out our videos, uh, subscribe, like us, follow us on Facebook. And uh, that's, that's it for now. Yep, we'll we're catch you go, next time. We're going to go and try to not be disappointed <laughs> or run into polls. <laughs> or or run into chargers. Yeah, or, or get no, caught oh, by cops. Mm, I, I like chargers. I may try that. <laughs> okay. okay. All right. All right. So until then, uh, we've been your hosts, Kirby Kid. And Jen. See you later, guys. See you.